when I was rejected from one of the company, then I prepared very well for the next. I am Shrijit Jain. I am currently pursuing B.Tech in Electronics and Communication from SVNID Surat and uh, my J.E. marks were 183 and rank was uh, 13,002. In my second year, I was part of Drishti and ACM and currently I am the Training and Placement Coordinator for uh, the year for the batch of 21 and 22. It was a campus recruitment. Mastercard came to our campus, uh, held an online test and the qualified candidates were called to their Vadodara office for the PI procedure. There were 45 questions, 15 from each, that is, uh, I think, communication, English and communication, uh, quantitative aptitude, and programming, basic programming. The job role was offered me after the interview procedure, I think, in the, in the month of January or so. Uh, so I was in the prepaid card service team and we were working around with the uh, data, the big data analytics uh, stuff. We were given uh, a data of prepaid card customers and we need to generate reports out of it. I, I need to study and learn about the DBMS database management system and business analytics software such as Tableau and Power BI. And the non-technical side, I really learned a lot about the management uh, side of because they conducted a weekly, I think a weekly meetup with the senior leaders of the company. Even we got a chance to meet the CEO of MasterCard. We learned a lot about on the non-technical side also. SVNIT is a great place for technical education. I think it always ranks in among the top institutions when it comes to ranking. Also, my expectations uh, were like what you see in the movies, but you never got those really. But uh, all in all, uh, when you uh, talk about the facilities, they are adequate enough for anyone. And uh, I think uh, education is also very good. In around 2017, when I was uh, looking about the stream which I need to pursue, uh, I was very much fascinated with about microprocessors that are uh, in the smartphones. I want to learn about them and you know, I, I want to develop some new technologies related to them. So that's why I chose uh, electronics and communication. When I was in my freshman year, I heard about that uh, this kind of committees have their orientations. Uh, and uh, I, I attended uh, almost every orientation. Uh, I basically choose them because I want to learn about their technologies. And I was really interested in the projects they were undertaking. You know, their motive especially the Drishti, their motive is to you know, develop some projects and always try to give back to the community. So that was something which I was uh, interested in and uh, wanted to pursue. I think uh, basically the learning attitude, because when you are in the first year, you are not expected to I think, know everything. So basically they are looking for a uh, loyal and uh, I guess uh, a good learning attitude is what they are looking for specifically with uh, some basic knowledge of program. The work you do in this committee always reflects about uh, what you do to pursue your interest. Suppose whenever you are in an interview, these things always helps you. They give you an upper edge because beyond curriculum, what you have done to improve yourself always matters in an interview. So that's why I think this is important for uh, anybody to join any of the community so that they can pursue their interest and develop. Being a student of such an esteemed organization, you are always presented with a plethora of opportunities you know, to learn. So when I was in the freshman year, uh, I, 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 was, uh, I think I was presented with a lot of opportunities to explore myself. And uh, when in the second year, when I joined Drishti, I explored myself in the robotics domain. And uh, there I developed my interest in image processing and that continued to machine learning and then computer vision and so uh, and when coming to the third year uh, I was you know, presented with this opportunity of doing an internship and uh, forthcoming that I was the TNP coordinator so 
you know the management skills are also there you are always developing in one way or of other but only thing is that the need is you need to get up and participate in everything that you are presented with the final year project is also about innovation so you know developing a system that can detect tumors in the ct images so that develops that, that develops the innovation skill in you so always there are opportunities it is only the individual that needs to get up and grab those opportunities basically i would say this certification are important they bridge the gap between the current academics and the industry the, the technologies the industries are deploying more important than certification is experience so i would tell that always focus on getting this opportunities of internship and freelancing rather than just focusing on certifications they are important but they are not as important as an internship work. but apart from this courses i would suggest that go to the university lectures of very prestigious universities such as mit or stanford they try to try to upload their whole lecture videos on youtube so that is also a great opportunity to choose the elective that in that matches with your personal interest don't go with your friends or you know choose the elective that gets you a good grade because in a short term it is great you you will have a great gpa but uh, when you look back you don't you know you you, you will i what do we say that uh, you will feel upset or uh, you will regret of it i was not very much interested in information security uh, still i i i choose it uh, but i learned a lot from it then in the current semester i choose image processing i think i think get rid of the word and choose what you want to do I advise them like talk to their seniors because uh, this was the thing which i lacked very much if i would was aware of this uh, i think the interview procedure was i was aware after i i was I, i came to college because when i was rejected from one of the company then i prepared very well for the next so i would suggest them uh, get uh, go to your seniors talk with them how this procedure works